Hi, this is Sai Morton with the daily update on Eurofix. I post my exclusive market overviews with the key political and economical events, charts and important levels on the forexpsami.com forums weekly. This short video is a response to rapidly changing situation of the currency markets and should help you to stay on top of the game and be profitable. I suggest you to visit forexpsami.com forum and read my analysis for the week before watching this daily video. Welcome back everybody, let's take a look again on the forex market. So yesterday we have put uh, the foundation for midterm perspective on forex and uh, cable your currency based on the dollar index. So as we discussed yesterday, dollar index shows clear patterns and actually signs that it intends to go higher. Supposedly uh, nearest standing destination point is 130 points, uh, which is suggested taking out of the recent lows as on your currency, as on the uh, cable, as on the gold, which is actually already has happened, as you can see. Uh, at the same time, performance of the euro currency and uh, Great Britain, uh, Great British pound stands a bit different. While euro currency stands in, in, in uh, sup intraday support, showing no activity, actually, Great British pound keep going lower. That is actually stands in a row with our expectation because as we talked about this, I will show you on the weekly chart where stand at the failure moment of the supposed head and shoulders pattern that might could happen from the XOP, but due to the few reasons, as we mentioned, while market were going lower here, was going lower here, that's a really big chance that market will fail. This is based on acceleration disrespection of the strong support areas and other reasons and tells us that we suggest it probably will be dropped below the lows. Besides on a fundamental point of view, it's, it's not everything good in United Kingdom right now. So corresponding to the situation in the, in the United States, uh, this is absolutely reasonable downside action. So with this downside drop, we expect an action somewhere to the 112 area um, in the nearest time within a few weeks maybe and uh, speaking on the balance between your and grip and cable you also could suggest the same performance if you take a look at the cross currency so here is weekly chart of the euro gbp so you could see that here is definitely acceleration and here you could see is still potential to the op target it actually might be not bad level for any speculative game so because that might be probably 618 resistance which is provide an agreement here and uh, for speculative purposes that might be interesting area around 8875 as you can see for scalp trading on the short side so the pounds here but still market has to move it past this area so it means that the cable has to drop faster than the euro currency in the current circumstances. Um, and if you'll take a look at the Great British Pound on the lower time frame, so uh, on the four different chart, we, we consider the butterfly extensions. The first one stands around 113.14 area, 1618 stands around 112. It's precisely 112 extension. So that will be logical point that, uh, and, and the pattern actually, which is potentially bullish reversal pattern, the butterfly that could trigger the bounce on uh, your GBP as well. So if we take a look, sorry, this monthly chart, this uh, weekly chart, that's corresponding and talking about the balance that we have. Uh, meantime, on the euro currency, as we discussed uh, recently, you could see that market stands in the 618 support, as I said, right there, and take a look here, market is forming something that looks like the minor hand and shoulders pattern. This is, well, very similar to what we have seen what we saw yesterday on the Bitcoin. We said we do not recommend to, to, to deal with it uh, because overall context stands not in favor of any bullish activity. Uh, the only attractiveness of the current situation that you could place very tight stop just because for economic circumstances you could place stop just below this area. And, uh, and But if you would like to trade, you could do this. So uh, that's up on to you. In the current, we have approximately the same story. So same 618 level, big drop, and a kind of the hand shoulders performance on a 30 minute chart. So we could see not quite the head and shoulders, but something like 
this uh, is forming here around 9980 support so um, once again for the fans if you are sure that market should show the bounce here well you do not need to place too far stop this risk somewhere around 25 30 pips you just need to place it below this area um, since this is not well perfect shape on the hand shoulders this might be also kind of the triangle consolidation that mostly also stands uh, bearish if pullback will happen don't count on the any significant action so it will be at the best it will be some kind of the abcd to the 30 percent resistance of the whole downward action something like this so it will be minor tactical bounce so that's been said for the bulls if you're just stubborn you would like to take the position uh, you could do deal with this patch for the bears uh, we could watch either for abcd retracement here to the 30 percent level of this recent drop getting the guardians cheaper to sell to consider the short entries round 150 probably somewhere around this level it will be or we should wait for taking out this loss and our continuation which also will be break out of the last level and on the daily chart it would mean that market is keep going lower will challenge this loss so that's uh, what the bears should keep an eye on so um, but anyway in general as i said this current situation is uh, well friendly for taking the short position when we have the general direction how to take the position this is um, well choices upon the trader so as we um, talked about this before the cpi numbers i said in most cases the best choice is a compromise so for instance while market calling inside the triangle you could try to position somewhere in this level if market somehow will show the abcd you could add more so just take the position not at the total volume but uh well 30 percent 40 50 percent not more than the 50 percent and then see what will happen of course uh most conservative approach is to wait for bounce here additionally you probably could consider taking the stop sell placing stop sell order near the lows so somewhere around 99 60 maybe 5 10 pips above the lows uh, using stop sell it will be triggered in the moment of the breakout this is also possible so as, as you can see uh, we have three options how you could possess yourself with the current uh, situation on your currency and uh, you just need to decide what fits more to your personality